Hello and welcome back to English Today for some more live English. Now, Jack, does he really care for Sharon? I think he does. Let's ask Mr. Monkey. Mr. Monkey, does Jack really care for Sharon? Mr. Monkey. Yes, yes, he agrees. He agrees. He cares. Now, in that episode, there were a lot of questions, and I want to practice that with you now. And to do that, we are going to have a quiz. I am going to change profession. I am no longer an English teacher. I have a different job. I will ask 10 questions. I will give the answers, and you must guess my new job. Now, if you guess it correctly, I will play a flight for you to go to London for a romantic weekend. How about that? Flight to London? So, 10 questions. Listen carefully. Number one. Do I work in an office? No, I don't. Number two. Do I work outside? Well, yes, actually, I do sometimes work outside. Next. Uh, do I have special qualifications? Oh, yes, I have special qualifications for my job. Okay, next one. Um, do I work at weekends? Yes, I do, actually. Most weekends, I work. So, I don't work in an office. I work outside sometimes. I have special qualifications, and I work at weekends. Okay, next one. Mm. Do you travel a lot? Oh, yes, I travel everywhere. I travel to America, to the Far East, around Europe, a lot. Do you earn a lot of money? Oh, yes, I earn a lot of money. <laughs> Next question. Do you use your hands when you work? Yes, I do. I use my hands and I also use my feet. Very important. Next one. Do you work with other people? Yes, that's very important. I work with other people. All right, next one. Do you use music in your job? Music? Yes, now music is very important for me, music. And the last question. Do you wear special clothes? Well, yes. For my job, I have special clothes. I have special shoes particular shoes, and I do my hair in a special way. So, I use my hands and my feet. I work with other people. I use music. I earn a lot of money. I wear special clothes, and I travel a lot. So, what's my job? Hmm? No. 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 It's difficult. Shall I tell you? I'm a prima ballerina. I won, you lost. No London, no flight to London. Next time, there'll be another quiz. All right, good. So, let's look at the grammar that we've just used for asking questions, okay? Now, we have the question form with... The question word, like when, the auxiliary, do, I, the subject, and then arrive, which is the verb. So, when do I arrive? Okay, that's a typical question in the simple present. Look at the next one. What do you do at work? What do you do? Next one. Now, this is important, and we need Mr. Snake, because it's who does he work with. Remember, does. Third person, the S, do, becomes does. So, who does he work with? Next one. 
Why does she study, third person? How much does it cost, again, third person, it? When do we leave? Where do we live? And how do they speak English? Okay, so remember, third person does is the auxiliary plus the infinitive. All right, so those are the English question forms. Now, in the next episode, listen out for the negative form and then we'll study that together, okay? So have fun studying and I'll see you again very soon. Bye.